Get a mixing bowl and put in 90 grams of butter. Hmm, it's all stuck. Make sure it's softened and just chuck it in. Add anywhere from three quarters of a cup to a cup of sugar. Now we want to mix this until it's nice and creamy. Now you want creamy peanut butter. Just add about 250 grams, which should probably be around three quarters of a cup or so. Now just mix this through. I'm just adding one egg and beat this in. Now get one cup of plain flour and just add that slowly while it's mixing. I get a baking sheet, baking paper, parchment paper, whatever. Or oh, I've got this silicone thing, I find that's a lot easier. Roll the mixture into balls really just depends on how big you want these cookies. You can make them different sizes and then you can pair up bigger ones with smaller ones. Now this mixture should make about 30 or so. So when you divide them and put them together with the center, you get about 15, 16. And you just push them down with a if you wish. Preheat your oven to about 180 degrees Celsius, which is about 350 degrees Fahrenheit. And then pop these in there. Should take about 12 to 15 minutes. Alrighty then. Now just let these cool just for about 10 minutes, then put them on a wide rack and do your next batch. And then we'll just put the filling in. Now that they're ready and have cooled down, just get your favorite jam, which is also called jelly or whatever. So these are so good, yummy peanut butter and jelly cookies. Then just get another one, push it down. Mm. There you go. Oh yeah. Simple cooking. Simple